Hi guys, welcome back to Jerusalem Playroom. And as you can see in the screenshot, I have two of the, are they called the Nana dolls? Well, anyway, guys, these are two that I found years ago. And I just happened to go through some of my old dolls and I came up upon these two guys. And I just, for some reason, um, have just these two little boys are like my, <laughs> I don't know, just have a special place that makes me smile. So I've decided that I'm going to keep them and put them somewhere in the playroom. And I was going to call them Luke and Lucas or maybe Luke and Logan, probably uh, two L names. I'm not for sure. And I'm not for sure who's going to be Luke and who's going to be Logan, but I just thought they were really, really cute. They do not have their shoes on. I don't know if they ever came with their shoes. Um, I know that one point they were like mass producing them, but I haven't seen them in a while. And I have another one. I just don't know where um, it's at. It is a, a girl version. But anyway, I do have a small little haul that I want to show you. So I'm going to put these two little guys on the side. There are several YouTubers, but there is one who I've been watching her channel a lot because she is obsessed with vintage clothing. And I was like, why is that lady so obsessed with vintage clothing? Well, that's her style. But as I was watching her channel, I was saying to myself, I said, well, some of that stuff that she's getting, I kind of like it myself. And so I... It, when I see little pieces, I go ahead and, you know, purchase them. And I saw something today that caught my eye. And I just went ahead and got it, guys. And let me show you. It is from, I got my glasses on today. Is this Bunny Baby? Yeah, Bunny Baby. So here is what it looks like. This is the little, and let me try to go out a little bit so you guys can see. But this is what it looks like, and it is a size 18 months. So what I said I was going to do, because I have Emily, I was going to put this on Emily and get her some lace socks and dress her up. And it did come with the little diaper covers here. But I just thought it was really, really cute. And the um, fabric on here is just great. I haven't washed it yet, which is why it still has the tag on it. And I think I paid... Um, $2.79 for it. So less than $3 for that. And I was kind of happy that I found it. And actually, Jerusalem can wear this too. I just, uh, I, I wish I had a little girl that I could dress. But right now, I just have my little dolls. But I, I just think this is really cute. So I got that. Next, I... <laughs> was going by the book section and I try to stay away from that because I have so many books but went by the book section and I saw this well immediately I picked it up but I noticed that it is a puzzle so um two dollars as you can see and I turned it around still sealed up so I my daughter was with me and I said well do you know anybody who likes um Encanto and she said, yeah, she said such and such likes it. And she has a birthday coming up. And I was like, are you serious? I said, well, this is a uh, wrap. This can be given as a birthday gift. I said, do you know if she liked puzzles? And she was like, yeah. So it says five puzzles inside. Um, and it's titled my first puzzle book. So this probably, I was trying to see if it had the age on here. And oh yeah, okay, not for children under three years of age. But I would keep this for myself, but I don't need it. So this is going to be a birthday book for a little girl. And I'm going to put some other stuff with it because I'm sure I probably can find something at the dollar store or whatever, coloring books, and give this as a gift. And for two dollars, that wasn't bad. Another um, item that I buy, I've tried to get out of getting bibs, but these just kind of popped out to me. And as you can see, they're 
they, I, I know that they're brand new. This one reads Squeeze the Day, and they were 99 cents. Look at this one with the rainbow. Be happy. And then this one here, Wear Your Best Smile. They had another one. They had two more, but out of um, all of them, I just like these three the best. So that's why I got those. Now, I really saw, when I saw this bag, I really wanted to get the bag because of this um, uh, Lala Loopsy doll. And I do not have my scissors again every time I do a video. So, um, this bag here was two, was it two ninety nine? Yeah. Which, so, and it has another little doll in there. So let's open this up and see what's in here. Now these dolls here, I think, ah, what, what, what were those babies called? And as you can see, she's dirty. She has to be washed. Oh, I forgot what these babies were called. Cause I got one. Kimby, Kendy dolls oh and she's soft too so um she was in the bag and she doesn't have any clothes on but i need to start trying to make some clothes i've said that one time before but i got her and she still has her be up just maybe i can find a diaper or something to put her on then i got her because i already had is her head yep i can probably put some hot her in hot water i already have the bigger sister so this is what i'm thinking guys she's missing her shoes but that's okay i'm thinking that these dolls were donated to the thrift store as a set and for some reason they probably separated them out of the box i don't know why but i have the other angel so I went ahead and got her and I'm just going to put her in some hot water and see if I can pop that dent out of her head because it's really hard. So that's why I got, I really got the bag just for her. Then, and also in this bag, I think they're called the Nana, Nana dolls. And here's one of her shoe. But look at her guys, the little pink hair, the little socks and i don't think the hat comes off no the hat doesn't come off so these are just something that i would keep in the playroom and just set them on the side but anyway she would go with those you know other dolls that i have and i think her face is really pretty so i wasn't a big fan of these but when you know you can't be getting three dollars for two dollars and 99 cents so that's what i what i got so let me put all of this to the side because i got a little bit more sit them right here Not that bad. now the next thing i got when i saw i forgot who what youtube channel i saw these dolls on um this bag here this bag here was uh 2.99 so you got total of let's see probably what 50 cents a dollar almost well yeah maybe a little bit more than that but they make great barbie babies so i went ahead and got them so because i have one and here what is this on her head Is it like a little bow? But I'm going to try to... I, I need to really try to make some little diapers and some clothes. Because I'm trying... I need to get crafty. Look at her with the little crown on her. With the little orange hair. And then these two are the same. So they could be um, twins. Yeah, I think these are daisies. So when I, you know, when I watch YouTubers channels and like I said, some of them, when they first come out with dolls, you know, the doll influencers, they always show the dolls or being sent things. And I just say, hey, I'll wait because eventually I will find them. So if I don't find any more of these, I'm good. But I got these for, for $2.99. Let me put them down here. And then the last item that I got this item here and i did and i'm gonna I'm be honest i got my grandson something because 
my daughter excuse me my daughter took me to the store and so I was like you know if you take me I will let you get something from my grandson so she did <laughs> Now this bag is three ninety. Was it three ninety nine? And the reason why I got this bag because I always try to find miniature dog clothes. So I want to go ahead and open this up with you guys. And I'm not showing myself today because I got off work early and I came home and I was just like I dealt with my dogs and I look a mess. So let's see what this is here. And lo and behold. This is a, look at that y'all, a preemie outfit. Hmm. And since I'm about to get ready and wash clothes, and let's see what this is. Okay. This is a little bag, like a diaper bag. And on the inside, it has some little bottoms. Underwear. Now, this is neat. Does that go with that? Probably so. Let me see. No, this is for a doll. Hmm. Very interesting. But it seems like it can match that since it's preemie. Okay. So we're going to just stuff that back in here. This cute little doll, doll bag. And let's see what else we got. Okay. Then we have this which is a little um sweater and i don't have a a doll that can wear this so i end up, i may end up throwing that back i don't know but we'll just put it to the side for right now and then look at that a little keychain or something that can be gone that can go on a purse oh it looks it was this was made guys i this is would be something that if my granddaughter made something like this i would have put it in a box and probably sealed it and let her open it when she got older to see what she made but i understand so i'm this is really who whatever little girl made this she's so special and she's so precious and she is gonna do some amazing things with her life by making stuff so i'm gonna keep this for the, and i don't know who she is but i just spoke something positive in her life because she she just talented okay and then let's see here uh oh guys that's that book that fell <gasps> now look at this as um i've been finding a lot of masks um, I have so many of them, and um, I'm not wearing it for uh, my own personal reason. I'm not going to get into that, but let's see here. I'm sure that I could probably do something and make a little outfit because I'm watching another YouTuber, and she is awesome. And uh, Crystal Lynn, Chrissy Lynn, I hope I'm saying her, her name right, but she makes beautiful stuff so i'm gonna see what i can do with that and take that all loose but i'm gonna set that to the side to wash it then i have this and i love collecting little uh dresses because my dolls need dresses they need things to wear so this one here <laughs> look at that and I was trying to learn how to do a pattern from another dress, other dresses, I mean, like this, and make my own. But I got a long way to go. But anyway, I'm sure one of the dolls can wear that. So that's got to be washed. And here is something looks like a little um, blanket. I'm trying to see, was it made or cut? Could have been cut. Looks like it could have been. And so things like that. When you're playing with your little dolls, let's see, let's fold it up here. You can fold it up and then wrap her, your little baby up in that like that. And I watch little shows like La La Lou, so that would be cute too to do that. 
then I think it's another one like that. And it looks like maybe this was a scarf or something, but you can use it for like uh, bedding. And I know I watch shows like My Froggy and I watch another one, um, Lena Craft. I think that's her name, how, she, how they just use little different stuff for their dolls. And, it's, and I, I like those shows like that. Guys, how about I'm thinking that this is um, something that I donated because <laughs> I had one. And so this is a zero to three months. Or is it still? I bet you this some. Because sometimes when I go in there and I try to. But this was in this bag. So we'll just keep that frog. And then finally, let's see what's in here. <laughs> this is a little dress. Okay. I just like to look at it. Let's see who it is. It says, let's. Plum Minis MK made in France. So this is some, um, no telling what it went to or whatever, but it is really cute, a little dress. And like I said, I can use dresses to dress up my baby alive dolls and things like that. So, but this I'm trying to see, I, I really don't have a need for it. So I'm going to, um, uh, donate this back to the thrift store and that's what I need to do I need to go through some stuff and go ahead and start donating some things okay so with that being said I'm gonna put all of that to the side and check this bag to make sure I don't have anything else and I do not and I'm gonna bring these babies and put these on the so I can get it on wash I'm going to bring these little guys back in. And like I said, I'm so happy that when I saw them, and actually I, I purchased them on two different, two different um, times. I didn't find them together. Well, let me bring their, let's see. We can make them like triplets. Because sometimes people have two boys and a girl or two girls and a boy. So they can be sister and brother. And we got the sister in here. So, Anyway, guys, I hope you enjoyed watching this and thank you so much. Stay tuned because you never know what's going to be in the playroom. Okay, bye guys.